Welcome back to the show. Kelly Ben Simone is still hanging out with me. Thank you so much for being here, lovely. Hi. You're looking fabulous as always. Thank you. <laughs> uh, which is why you should be on Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, actually, because, yeah, those ladies, they, they bring they the fashion. They dress, love. Yes. And oh last night God. was no exception. The ladies were looking juicy, and, of course, the drama was <laughs> just as juicy. So Lisa Vanderpump, of course, did not attend the reunion. At the top of the show, Andy revealed that he had heard Lisa told a reporter that she had decided to quit the show, and the ladies, well, they had some thoughts. Watch. I think she gave that interview yesterday so that she could say she quit because she knew that if she didn't show up here today that you would probably do the same thing that you had to do with Adrian and fire her. So she was preempting getting fired by saying she quit yesterday. So Kelly, oh. what's your opinion on this? Do you think that Lisa quit to avoid being fired? Do you think she was ever in danger of being fired? What is your what is your opinion? I love Lisa Vanderpump, and I love that she's actually taken it to another level, and she has Vanderpump Rules, which is another one of my favorite shows, we by do. the way. Yeah. Um, so I really admire her. I think she's super smart. And she dropped the mic. She was like, guys, you're great on the couch. Enjoy yourself. I'm going to be watching you from my couch. Right. And um, the whole idea of fire is that those are very ambiguous for letters together. Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, fire to if fire in the real world and fire in reality is a totally different thing. Yeah. But I think she's amazing and I think the girls are kind of like I can think that they're what they're trying to say is, hey, I wish you had could have sat with us so we could have kind of hashed it out and then, you know, you could have left and we could have like, you know, tied a bow on that. Right. I think it was more closure. like that. Yeah. Like with any end of any relationship. Yeah, not really. just like see ya, but yeah. well, she did drop the mic, which yeah. is kind of, you know, very like superstar love. Right. Yeah. She's a superstar, she's a queen. But with Lisa <laughs> gone, who will be the new queen bee? Can Kyle carry the way of the crown? Let's have a look at that. No, I the queen thing makes me laugh, but that's sweet thing. But it's true. Look who showed up. So I agree. Well, she's one of the original. She's the agree, last but not original only is she the member. original, she's the leader of the group. She is the leader. How is she the leader of the because group? Because she is the one that we are all connected to. Well, I'll tell you what, was one fan was not on board with the passing of the crown tweeting this. Sorry, Erica, you don't choose the queen and the crown isn't inherited. The fans crowned the queen and this crown left with the queen. So oh, Kelly, right? my God. I, are off. I love these fans <laughs> so much. I know, they're very passionate. Oh my God, on Twitter, you have to follow. There's like an actual fan site that, that you can join yeah. and they just go crazy. And sometimes like some of the housewives will go in and, in, in and out because it's really interesting to hear what the fans have have to say. Yeah. Um, do I think that the queen is, you know, if there's a new queen? The fans really decide that. I mean, mm -hmm. we can sit there and say like, oh, you know, I know you and you from her, from you, but it's really the fans decide like who is, like in Mean Girls, they decide like who's the who's going to be the one that's going to really yeah. make the decision. Who's going to be the Regina George? <laughs> exactly. Who would be the Regina right? George? Well, who would you who would you give the crown to, in your opinion? Uh, you know these ladies. I don't know. I, I'm a big fan of Lisa Renna, and mm -hmm. I just love the way she she dances. She's got a really good spirit, a really good mindset, and I feel like she is a good queen just because she's an amazing diplomat. Right. And but she's also very discerning, very honest. She's a good businesswoman outside of the show. So she's like the transparency of on and off camera is really good, and I yeah. think that that shows like a good queen.